Hey, heads up everybody, this is Randy Mason live from the kitchen table and here's how you can get a head start in your day so that you can stay ahead of the curve. What's holding you back and keeping you from accomplishing your goals and your dreams? Likely a very long list of excuses. And I know very well that excuses are like numbers they never ever end. There's never a shortage of excuses, trust me. I have plenty of excuses, sufficient excuses. If I told you even just a few, you'd say, Rand, it's all right. Be ordinary, be complacent, be mediocre. You've just got way too much going on. There's no possible way that you can do the things that you have on your heart and mind. But I'm like, that's not cool. What I'm learning to do is use my excuses to evoke my efforts, to determine my efforts, okay? Normally we say, hey, I cannot do X, Y, Z because of A, B, C. But what I'm learning to do now is say, I can and will do X, Y, Z, and I'll do it this way because of A, B, C. This morning I woke up an hour and a half late, excuse number one. But I said, you know what, I'm gonna get up anyway. I'm gonna get to the things that I have set and the things that I have planned. I'm still gonna go and make an effort to achieve my goals this morning. I prayed, had in a word, I got with God, and then I got dressed and said, all right, I'm gonna go for a run. When I opened the door, it was pouring rain. Excuse number two. Hey, it's pouring rain six in the morning, you woke up late, go back to sleep. But I say, you know what, no, no, no. I'll put a hoodie on and that'll protect me from the rain. So that's solution number one. I'll run a shorter distance than I normally do so that way I can get back home in time to kick it with my wife before she goes to work. Solution number two. So what I did essentially was I let the excuses kind of evoke my efforts, determine my efforts, and inform the solutions that were necessary for this morning in order for me to be successful. Don't be defeated by your excuses. Master them and use them to become effective and efficient in the things that you need to do. When excuses are ample and solutions are scarce, efforts will tip the scale. That'll be the determining factor. Every day you wake up in the morning and you have a whole bunch of excuses, just like the rest of us. I'm no different from you, but you gotta make the effort. When the excuse comes because we know they're always there, use it to determine, to fuel, to evoke your effort. Make it a good morning. Remember that the morning is a terrible thing to waste, so get up and keep your head up. This is Randy Mason. Until next time, peace.